<laughs> Morning, lamb. Sorry. Didn't mean to scratch at the collar. Them thing is itchy. Even after all these years. How am I feeling? Well, relieved, I suppose. Been on death row for three years now. I'm getting tired of waiting for you humans to do what would have taken a werewolf ten seconds. One more field trip on the prison bus before I have to say goodbye to my favorite fluffy little prison guard, hmm? <laughs> Why I killed them all doesn't matter, Lamb. I'm afraid you'll have to just accept that is my final answer. But don't look so down, hmm? You aren't meant to be treating us monsters kindly at all, much less monster prisoners. The other prison guards will keep mistreating you. <laughs> About that and your figure, which, for the record, I think is delightful. <laughs> I mean it. Werewolves appreciate padding. Good for keeping warm in the winter. <sighs> Damn dirt roads. Feels like the collar gets tighter with each bump the prison bus hits. Mon cher, don't look sorry for a washed up old werewolf. I'll be able to fill it off me soon enough. Same as the other unfortunate souls here. <laughs> oh no, I don't mean at prison. You might want to hide behind me, little lamb. Otherwise... Rest yourself now, mon cher. The prison bus took quite the nasty fall. Well, of course I planted the bomb on the bus before we left. You didn't really think I was going to let the humans put me down like a literal dog, right? I was so worried when I saw you were going to be on it with me. But I wasn't going to let any harm come to you. You're a little shaken up, but all your parts still work. I assume. <laughs> What's wrong, human? All I did was let you borrow my collar while we walked out this way. Didn't want you wriggling away while I got you home. <laughs> it does look most fine on you as well, my squishy little lamb. <laughs> Come now, let Papa take a look at ya. You humans are so fragile compared to my kind. Hush now, don't strain yourself. We're in one of your abandoned human towns on borrowed sunlight. Second the sun goes down, well, I reckon any nearby werewolves will start sundowning. Mm -hmm. Somewhat like the human condition, yes. Save that we go absolutely feral for fulfilling certain needs. Food being the major one, and, well, finding a mate. <laughs> if you're going to survive tonight, Lamb, you need to make a decision, and quick. When they come sniffing, a fight will be inevitable. I can take them, but if I lose myself to the bloodlust, I need a way to know that you aren't going to be harmed. No matter the cost. Very smart, Lamb. Yes, that would mean marking you as my mate. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> what if you say no? You're cute to think I'd give you a choice. Either way, now. Come here. <laughs> Struggle all you want. Just let me expose that pretty shoulder of yours. There we are. You struggle all you want, sweetheart. It's the only way to guarantee I don't fling your guts across the room while you're chained up. Believe me or not, I don't want my little lamb heart. Feel how tense you are with my teeth around your neck, tongue licking the sweat up your throat from the collar. Gods, you look beautiful, tugging at the collar, the little human. Oh, what's that? <laughs> oh, lamb, you really do have the blood of the innocent. Even if you were moaning something fierce during that bite. <laughs> Don't fall over now. Come on. The bathroom will have to do. Easy now, my dear, easy. See, when your old pal Virio looks more human than wolf, he's reasonable. A little grumpy, sure. Maybe growls a few times a certain guard gets one over on him in good faith. But when I go for a wolf, that'll be gone, lamb. I'm going to change in here after killing every other wolf that comes sniffing. And you're going to have to pray that I'll remember you're mine now. Oh, don't cry now. When the sun goes down, round these parts, all humans must be inside and urge to make peace with their god, right? You already make peace with your god, sweetheart. And I'd like to think I'm the worst sadist monster you could be chained up with. At the end of the day, <laughs> guess we'll see. <laughs>